have appeared in walls of many boys growing up. But now these custom lowriders are getting built right here on home soil. They're the brainchild and creative talent of Zaire Davids, who took his love for the bikes and built it into a unique city business that is known for some outstanding works of art. All of the lowrider bikes and motorcycles are hand-built in his garage, with the technical knowledge acquired from a local library out of necessity. I was actually retrenched and um, I couldn't find work anywhere and thought, you know what, um, let's build a bicycle instead. I couldn't afford a car. And um, at the time I had absolutely no idea of the skill set and the business aspect of it. So it was pretty much all self-taught. Now some 20 years later his business has grown and so has his customer base who are attracted by the prospect of customization and having a unique one-of-a-kind showpiece. I say a lot of my bikes has the lowrider influence, very low slung, stretched out, um, cruiser, commuter type of, of, of feel to it. However, I do build custom bikes for physically disabled people as well as for corporates and, and businesses. The quality of lowriders speak for itself and not even the harm the business has on the environment is spared with this custom electric trike. From corporates to the man in the street, he's managed to build a formidable reputation due to his high craftsmanship. This is nothing like I've ever seen. I mean, I haven't seen anybody in Cape Town yet with this type of work or producing the things he does produce, so it's pretty amazing. For now, flywheel custom chariots will continue to push the boundaries of art, practicality and affordability for many Cape Townian low-riding enthusiasts who are finally getting to love out their dreams. Revis Andrew, CGTN, Cape Town.